and welcome back to my run of 1 vs 100 in which I'm starting game 2 with a one game winnings total of $59,000. Load clear. As soon as it'll load up because once again I'm playing through the uh, what's his face? The instant preview window on my Elgato thing. Blah 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 blah. I know the rules. These are three possible answer choices. Like I didn't know that. Okay, so this time let's get to know a little more about this mob. Five accountants. Five doctors. Five magicians. Five librarians. This game is simple. Five lawyers. Oh, that's it? We can't know about the other 75? Well, that's gotta stink. Anyway, first question. Get up your truck and tell us which movie starred Vin Diesel. Gas up your truck. Never mind. Might as well pull the mob again. Because I don't know anything about Vin Diesel. Oh, can I not use a mo Can I not use a help here or something? There it is. Well, well what the heck happened? Was I, like, it's like pushing the wrong button? Okay, The Young Indiana Jones Chronicles. I know The Chronicles of Narnia. I don't think that could have starred Vin Diesel. Two people said The Young Indiana Jones Chronicles, so therefore I'm going with The Chronicles of Riddick. As the one that starred Vin Diesel. The correct answer is... Wait, which Narnia movie? The Lion, the Witch, and Wardrobe? Oh, thank God. So how many people said the Narnia? Two. Two said the Chronicles of Narnia. The other two said the Young Indiana Jones Chronicles. Fantastic. Thank God I got through that question. You're most likely to see a Jolly Roger flag on what kind of ship? A pirate ship. As soon as we'll load. Answer is... Yeah. I'm like, it better be a pirate ship. Oh good, it is. Fantastic. Like, I was about to... On that first question, I was about to just give up and straight up look, the an look up the answer so that I could actually get past it. Because I guarantee you... As you can plainly see right there, I would have gotten past it, because I did, with the use of a help. Break out the pastels and put a t-shirt under your suit. Which detective would you not encounter on Miami Vice? Okay, this one I'm trusting the mob. Because I don't know. I don't watch Miami Vice. Oh, God damn it! it's happening again. Fantastic. How many times do you expect me to get past this? You already know which help I'm using. I'm going to trust the mob on this one. Because I have no idea. Answer is Frank Dragon. Okay. So now do I think about Frank Dreven was in police squad in the naked gun. Okay, so I have to be like a 40-year-old to be able to answer these. Thanks. So I finished around with thirteen thousand uh, dollars. Might be might be a dumb idea for me to do this, but I'm taking them off at this early stage of the game. What parade went on as planned in New Orleans in February 2006, less than six months after Hurricane Katrina? February. Mardi Gras, Fat Tuesday. So, yeah, that's got to be Mardi Gras. That makes sense. The correct right? answer is... Mardi Gras is a New Orleans thing. Okay, good. And Mardi I happen to know that Mardi Gras comes after, like, the beginning of Lent, which is, you know, in February. So, yeah. It's another thing that helped out a lot. Okay, so I got one more question to go before I think about what I want to do for the next question. Oh, wow. Not many people are getting these wrong this time. 
Earth. It was fun while it lasted. In Armageddon, what are Bruce Willis and Ben Affleck trying to save the world from? Alright, time to use the last help. Again? Oh. I was like, if it'll let me. Okay. I had a... Okay. Police officer. I had a case where this came up. My mom told me when I was a kid. Oh boy. Okay, so a police officer said... A police officer said... I had a case... Where this came up. Armageddon? You were discussing Armageddon with a... With the guy you were stopping or something? And the doctor said, my mom told me when I was a kid. Oh boy. So one said C and the other said A. Armageddon. I'm... <laughs> well, I'm more likely to believe the police officer anyway, and something on the ground just doesn't make a lot of sense to me. I'm going C. Something from Sace. The correct answer is... Yay, I got it! Now, how many people got that wrong? Only five. Far smaller payday than the last, the last one. Do I don't know. Do I dare money? go for the mob or do I take the thirty-nine thousand? This will be my last game anyway. Of the night. Not that I'm going to. Uh... I want the mob. For three thousand dollars per wrong answer, and I only get, and I only have to worry about one question. <sighs> Settle in. Which took more turns of the clock? The longest modern era baseball game. That had to be about. That had to be about eight hours. Average flight from New York to DC. Okay, I have to think that the longest modern era baseball game was in was indeed eight hours. So, the original Star Wars trilogy. That has to be about six hours. The average flight from New York to DC. Now let's let's think a minute. My flight from Virginia to I'm going with the longest modern mayor baseball game. I'm confident that it's that that one was eight hours. Yeah, eight hours. The correct answer is. Yeah. Eight hours, six minutes. I was right. How about the apples? Now, how many people got that one wrong? Only a few, once again. But the, hey, that's good for eighteen thousand. That'll put my total for this game up to fifty-seven thousand, and this time I what am indeed the taking the money. money. Give me the money. I got slightly further than before, but almost as much as my last as game one. So now when we add that to 59,000, that'll put my two game winnings total for the plug and play version of 1 vs. 100 to 116 thousand dollars. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you for game 3 whenever.